welcome to La Cucina Familia. I'm Angela Dominic, and today we're going to be making some pasta. I've actually brought some friends with me today to help me out. I've got Jordan over here. Say hi, Jordan. Hi. And then we have Juliet and Sydney. Hello. And what we're going to do today is we're going to make some lemon fettuccine with a just a butter and Parmesan cheese that I bet the kids are going to think is really yummy. And then in our second segment, we're going to make some spinach raviolis with some vegetarian nona sauce. So I think we're going to be all set to get started, guys. What do you think? You all ready for this? Yeah. You guys ready to help me out make some pasta today? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So Juliet, I'm going to have you go off over with mom for a minute. And Jordan and Sydney and I are going to make the first batch of pasta. No. Go ahead. Will I crack the eggs now? You are going to crack some eggs now. Jordan, what I'm going to have you do is crack three eggs, one, one at a time, one egg in the bowl, and put your shells over here. And Sid, I'm going to have you, let's take the lids off the flowers. And this is going to seem kind of silly because we're just going to pile the flour right on the counter. But I'm going to have you put two cups of flour on the counter for me. Yep, go right ahead. How many cups of these? Two. So we'll start with the first one right in the middle. Very good. And you can crack your first egg if you'd like, Jordan. Keep it back a little bit more so we're not near the edge. Look at that. Put your shell in the bowl. Now wait on the second one because we'll put them in the middle of the well. And I'll just yeah. take it out. Okay, very Pull good. It. And then one of the white flour. Okay. We're going to make pasta the, the traditional with the, yeah, the right in the middle. Absolutely. Um, by hand on the first one. Go ahead and crack the second egg right in the bowl. We're going to mix our semolina. We're using two cups of semolina today. Make sure you don't have any shells. Good job. Right in the bowl. Okay, let's give you something to wipe your hands on in case you get messy. We're using a combination of semolina, which is our yellow flour, which is a whole grain. Um, it's before the flour gets cracked, and a cup of white flour. We'll just get them all mixed together. Perfect. And make a little well in the middle. Getting all flowery? <laughs> all right, now we're going to drop Jordan's eggs right in the middle of the well. Looks kind of scary, doesn't it? Ooh, we don't want him to run away. See how we got a little well? Now Ooh. we're going to take the spoon, the fork, excuse me, and whip up the eggs a little bit. Okay. Now, Sydney, I'm going to get you started on your next job. Ooh, don't let it go. <laughs> Pretty fun, huh? Yeah. All right. Jordan, can you hand me a lemon for Sydney? Very good. And mm -hmm. then Sydney's going to take the lemon zester. And you're going to zest some lemon. You can do it right on the counter because we're going to mix the lemon. We're going to make a lemon fettuccine today. Excuse me? Yeah? Can I try to? To mix them? Let me get it a little so bit mixed. Like to, um, to, to, um, zest? Yeah. We're going to let Sid do the zesting today. How's that? Okay. You got to crack the egg. Sid's got to have a job. Okay. You all set? Yep. Yeah, let me show you. Look at what we got going on. Oh, Let's wow. get this. Yeah. <laughs> never so just pour stuff. <laughs> well, imagine what it's going to taste like cooked. I never <laughs> just pour stuff on the counter. I know. It seems kind of silly to do it that way, doesn't yeah. it? See how it's coming all together? Now we're going to get the lemon in there because we're going to mix that. So that? what? let me show you real quick how we do it. Hold your zester okay. and take your lemon and just go just like that. Just down? Okay. Just down. Just like that. Okay. And see it all coming off? And then we're going to mix it right in there with it. All right. OK. So we're making lemon-flavored pasta. Have you guys ever had lemon pasta Never before? So. No? You like lemon, though, right? Yeah. Yeah. Should be Can pretty push yummy. It down, push it down a little hard so, so you could get a little bit more. But you don't want to get any of the white. So keep moving the lemon. Let's just put it all in the pile. What happens if you get the white? Well, the white is called the pith, and the pith has got a little bit of bitterness to it, and we don't want bitter pasta now, do we? No, <laughs> careful. All right, now Man. slide it all in there. That looks so good. It's starting to smell really good, too, isn't it? Yeah, <laughs> Look at all the zest. Oh, yeah, that's perfect. That's exactly what you want. Keep it on the counter. Let me see your lemon. Looks like we got a pretty bald lemon there, so we've done a great job. Let's slide it all in. Oh now use, stuck in here. yeah, that's what you do. Use your finger, and you just go just like that. And there's all Isn't your lemon that zest. Dangerous? 
Now, this side, if you were to go down, is a little bit sharp, but only sharp enough so it takes the top of the lemon off. You see that? It just takes that little bit of the lemon off. And then we'll bang it in there. Can I try mixing it up? I'm actually going to have you help me do the, the kneading of the pasta. What's the kneading? I'm going to show you how to do that. Let's get this mixed a little bit better first. And we actually are going to use a little bit of the water that's over there next to you too, Jordan. So you see that little bowl of water? Very good. Yeah, move the water over for me. Perfect. Very good. Now is when we're going to get messy. You ready to get messy? Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> we're going to put a little bit of water in, and then I'm going to start bringing this together by hand. Oh. Pretty cool, huh? <laughs> Can I try it? As soon as I get it together, I'm going to have you do the kneading for me, and I'll teach you exactly what that is. You want to pour a little tiny bit more water, just a little drip, right in the middle there. Good, Oops. good. That's all right. The flour is going to suck it right up. Wow. It's like magic water. <laughs> <laughs> it smells so good already. Yeah, I smell it too. It smells, I smell the lemon. It's you really strong. Yeah, the lemon zest is where all the oils are in the lemon. So that's what's going to make all the, all the flavor so bright. All right, one more little drip of water, and I think we'll be good, Jordan. You ready? Okay. Right in the middle. And then I'm going to get it all pulled together, and then you're going to need. Perfect. Good, good. Perfect. Nice. Nice. That's my line. <laughs> Sydney and Jordan, um, when they come to dinner on Sundays, because this is my nephew Jordan and my niece Sydney, my uh, brother-in-law's kids, and when they come to dinner on Sunday, a lot of times Nona makes pasta homemade, doesn't she? Yeah. What does she make it into? She makes um, yonkies and... What else? What's the thing that everybody loves that Nona makes? Ah, uh, um... Raviolis? Mm, oh yeah, known <laughs> yeah, as raviolis. There we go, last one. Okay, you ready? Yep. Okay, I'm going to move it over to you so then I can wipe up and get the uh, machine ready. Okay. See what I'm doing? Yep. We're just folding it in and using the palm of our hands. Is, ne is kneading um, put like um, flattening out the dough? Kneading is mixing it all together, but we're doing it with our hands instead of with a machine today. Can I try it? Yep, absolutely. Let's pick up the rest of this flour and hand it off. Okay, you ready? Yep. Let's move this stuff so you got a spot. Get the lemon out of the way. Bald lemon. <laughs> the bald lemon, exactly. <laughs> That's what we're looking for. <laughs> all right, so just go fold it in and push it down with your hand. Like, like this? Push it real hard. Use all your muscles. Yeah, very good. Now fold it again. Watch. There you go. Perfect. Nice. Push real hard. You want to try too? Yeah. Let's give Jordan a couple more rounds, and then we'll get okay. you in here to try. Is it hard? <laughs> You're doing a great job. Let's give Sydney a try, all right? You ready, Sid? Yep. Pull it all together a little bit. All right, there you go. Okay, go ahead. Just fold it over. And fold it over and push it with the heel of your hand. Yeah, push hard. You got to stand up on your tippy toes. Even Auntie has to stand up on her tippy toes to do it. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Why do you have to stand on your tippy toes? Well, so you get a real good push on it because it's a little bit hard to do, but it comes together real quick. I mean, how long did that take? And we just made homemade and it's pasta. Hard to do if I'm on my, if yeah. I'm on my well, that doesn't take there a lot. <laughs> there we go. All right. So what we're gonna do next is we're gonna set the pasta aside. Are we both gonna be able to do this? Yeah, we're gonna roll the pasta out with the Ooh. with the machine all together. Can I try it first? Because I'm a really good at that. You're really good at yeah. that, yeah. You do this at home? Yep. Sometimes all right. Dad likes something like oh, he wants to cool. make it by himself. He gets his pasta maker and we make pasta. And there it is. Yep. Lemon Ooh. pasta. All right, let's clean up our mess a little bit. Can I smell it? You sure can. How about if you hold on to it for us? Oh. Sid, I'm gonna go right to the sink next to you and give my hands okay. a rinse. Go ahead. There we go. All right, we ready? 
and the pasta machine. Pasta machine. What do you think? Put it in. No, we have to cut it first. But with the pasta machine, you have three different sections. One to make spaghetti, one to make fettuccine, and one to make raviolis with. So are we going to use doing? We're going to use fettuccine, fettuccine today. Yep. All right, set the pasta down, and Can let's I grab... It? Yeah, we're going to grab a knife real quick. Oops. Right here. Sorry, I forgot a knife. When we used this last time, Dad made ravioli. Cut off a strip right there. Don't go real hard, just, just to cut through a little bit. Perfect. All right, good. Because we'll just rip it the rest of the way, because we don't want to cut. There we go. So we're just taking a little piece. All right. And we have to flatten it down, because it's got to fit through those holes. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> you rubbing your belly? <laughs> yeah. Can I try it out? Yep, I'm going to run the first one through, and you're going to catch it for me, and then we can all do it together. We're going to run it through the... Uh, the flat one first, nice and wide, so we can get it thin. Hold your hand right over here, Jordan. Okay, you ready? Mm. You gotta start cranking. Sid, help me hold the machine down, all right? All right, here we go. Move your arm back just a little bit. All right, here comes the first pasta. Get ready to catch it over here so they can see us. Back up a little bit, there you go. Perfect. The first part, Can here I we go. First? Yeah, here we go. Now's the part you're going to do. You ready to crank? Yep. Go ahead. Start cranking. Hold it down, Sid. Okay. Here we go. Crank. Oh. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, but it turned my fingers when I'm using it. We'll turn Magical. it to the side. There we go. Are we going to use that one? Nope. Or is that pasta? That's no, pasta. that one's, yeah, that one's spaghetti too, but this one's the fettuccine. See that? Wow. Can I, can me and Sydney have a little piece? You don't want to eat it raw. It's got raw eggs in it. Oh, no, that'll make it sick. Yeah. Mm. Get another piece cut because this isn't going to be enough to feed everybody. So we're just going to start piling up some pasta. Pasta pile. Pasta nests. Absolutely. You ready to do this again? I want to do it. Yep. You're going to roll this time. Now flatten it. you got to flatten it all out first, Jordan. Flatten it or I'll jam it. Yeah. We don't want that to happen. We don't want that to happen. Very good. Nice. All right. Now, Sid, you're going to crank. That means you're going to sure. switch spots with me so I can hold the machine down. You ready, Jordan? Yep. I'll put it in. You put okay. it in. I'll hold it for you. Okay, okay. Go ahead and get ready to catch it. I got the machine. There you go. Here it comes. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> oh. Oops. <laughs> Are you having fun? Yeah. Yeah. Oops. You held it better than I did. <laughs> do I get to crank it into the fettuccine? Uh, yep, you oh. do. Fettuccine? And now we're going to make it can some... You hold, can somebody hold it? I'll send it through, and you get ready to crank. Can, can somebody wanna pick it up? I'll pick it up. Yep, we'll get it. Go ahead, right through. Ooh, and here comes some more. It's like a car wash. For <laughs> a car wash for spaghetti. All right, put it on the plate, and let's do one more. Make it a good one. Make it like a good. big one? No, that's prob that's perfect because it's got to be skinny enough to fit through the machine. Yeah. Good. Don't cut all the way through. But I want to. Yeah, just be careful. There you go. Perfect. Right there is good. You don't want to cut all the way through. There you go. Pull it. Perfect. All right. Squish it flat. You guys are doing great. You don't even need me. <laughs> yeah. That's not good. You don't want to eat the raw egg. Yeah, I know, but no, I got to turn to crank it. Yep, Jordan's going to have a turn to crank it. So let's move the machine down a little bit. Go ahead, Jordan. You help hold it. Okay. 